Again, a violent beginning to the school year for our area. Fights breaking out at Butler and Aiken High School, three fights at Burke County High School, and then Wednesday, the student shot inside Josie High School. And when we hear these stories, sometimes the knee-jerk reaction is to think metal detectors can solve the violence, but as Mel Rio shows us, not all security systems are made equally. Josie High School's shooting is now another data point for the increasing violence in schools across the country. So what's the solution for school districts to reduce or prevent these problems? It's an AI-based weapons detection system. Evolve Technology is one of the largest companies implementing their detectors in schools across the country, including Spartanburg, Atlanta Public Schools, and Clayton County Schools. Something looks like a part or piece of a mass casualty weapon, the system will alert, it puts a red bounding box around the area of the body or the belonging of that entrant that needs to be checked. And so what this does, Will, is it actually allows for much faster screening processes. But are AI-based weapons detection systems really catching everything coming into our schools? The smaller you get with the, your weapon, whether, whether it's a gun or a knife, it inherently becomes more difficult for the systems to um, detect them. IPVM is an independent security research firm. Their report shows systems like Evolve and other AI weapons detection systems often don't catch compact handguns and small knives. When security works, it's because of people. When security fails, it's because of people. And we need to focus on training our school staff, not just putting in shiny objects that we can point to, create a false sense of security, and then have those systems failed. Kenneth Trump with the National School Safety and Security Services says metal detectors aren't working either. <laughs> Machines often don't work 100% of the time and aren't manned 24-7. It's a wicked problem. It's very complex, uh, and there is no single solution. In Augusta, Will Rio on your side. The National School Safety and Security Services says the number one way to find out about weapons in school is if kids come forward and tell an adult they trust.